Welcome back, everyone, to celebrate its 25th anniversary. PC Magazine is hosting a computerlicious design experience. It's where laptops have been dramatically redesigned, all in the name of charity. And PG, PJ Jacobowitz of PC Magazine and top handbag designer Rebecca Minkoff are here to tell us about how you can get your hands on one of these coveted computers and also do a very good deed. PJ, Rebecca, thank you so much for joining You're us. Welcome. Hey, thanks for having us here. Tell us about this effort. I've never seen computers look like laptops look like this. They're absolutely beautiful. Tell us what it's all about. Sure, that was the goal. So basically it was uh, PC Magazine's 25th anniversary and we decided to do something you know that people haven't seen before. HP helped us out, gave us some of their top of the line laptops and then we went to some of the best creative designers in the business like Rebecca here and we had them just totally trick out these laptops with these new designs. And so uh, they're actually going to be sold off on eBay starting tomorrow. And uh, all of the uh, ev all the prices, uh, they're going to start at 99 cents. Really? And all the money is going to go to uh, a charity. And so what is the charity? It, it's to provide computers to underprivileged yeah. people? Yeah, it's the uh, Christina Foundation. Mm -hmm. So it's uh, they basically do training and give used equipment to uh, people and charities and, and organizations in need. All right. How did you pick a, a, who would be the designers of the laptops? Did you get a lot of applicants? Um, you know, there, there were just so many great people to choose from. And uh, when PC Magazine asked for a favor, they can't oh. refuse. Well, they're so, pretty amazing. Uh, <laughs> Let's talk to Rebecca for a minute. What did you design? I, I mean, you really were given just, you know, a blank canvas. You were given a laptop and told, yep. do what to it? I was basically given a laptop and said, you know, redesign it, do what you want with it. And I thought, you know, I'm a handbag designer. And one thing that's missing from the market is, like, actually nice laptop bags for women. So Absolutely. I thought I would use my skills to kind of make a bag for it. So tell us about the process. I mean, how does one... One, you know, change a laptop. You're dealing with an electronic <laughs> device. Yep. You can't, you know, I wouldn't think you could do too much to it in terms of using glues and uh, different processes. So what did you do with your laptop? Originally, um, we were actually trying to make this its own case. So mm -hmm. gluing the handles to it and, you know, that didn't quite the work. The actual laptop. Exactly. Mm -hmm. um, so Which would have been brilliant if it could work. It would have been great, but yeah. we had to leave uh, the bottom open for it to breathe. and uh, so, Tricky. Uh, yes. So we decided to cover it in leather and uh, stamp it with uh, my initials, which is a, uh, something we do on a lot of my bags, mm -hmm. and then just make a really great eye-catching laptop bag with lots of pockets, a little bit of patent leather Love in the there. Bag. It's so true, though, yeah. that out there in the market, there's just nothing, you know, designer or, you know, even feminine to put a laptop nothing. in. Yeah. And PJ, to show us, walk us through some of the other designs. You have, I don't know if folks can see this at home, it's covered, this is also covered in, in leather. Right. Uh, this is designed by um, a company called Obey. This is actually the HP uh, DV9000. The code name is the Dragon. It's mm -hmm. a 20-inch display. It's supposed to be a desktop replacement all in one. I mean, this is a gigantic laptop that can, uh, great for multimedia. It's got a real powerhouse underneath it. All right, and you've got a little tiny one there also, but yep. it's uh, it's kind of got a, a, a collage design. How would you describe this? Um, this one, actually, there's a lot of newspaper clippings. Mm -hmm. If you look close at it, it's got a lot of uh, political, artsy things going on here. But um, And it still works. It still functions as a laptop. It still totally functions. Great laptop. It's actually a tablet, so you can write right onto it. Oh, cool. Yeah. And this one is, is interesting. I don't know how they were able to do this. Uh, this, uh, I, you know what? I'm not exactly <laughs> sure. This is from Paul Frank, and this also is a Dragon laptop. And, uh, yeah, incredible, incredible. Uh, their signature, you know, monkey thing going on. Maybe, you know, perhaps... A monkey it was, thing going on. <laughs> Do you have any concept as to how much each of the laptops will sell for on eBay, or are you really you know just putting it out there? We know what they'll start for, and that's 99, 99 cents. cents. So um, I really have no idea. I know that if I do purchase this for someone I'm interested in, yeah. they will love me forever. <laughs> so, uh, so that's probably worth a lot. All right, well, thank you both thank so you. much for joining us. It's a, a good deed, a good cause, and you get yourselves great laptops as well. So thank you. And for more information about computer de computerlicious design experience, you can log on to WNBC.com slash weekend T-I-N-Y. That's today in New York.